welcome. Take a few moments to let yourself arrive into this sacred space. A space where you can witness yourself. To intimately connect with yourself. No matter that you have entered this space from your device online, it is no less sacred. A blessed temple you are held within. Arrive here, knowing you are safe. Connect with your breath, the intimacy of witnessing your being. Adjust yourself however you may need to, so that you are honoring the sanctity of this space. The more of your presence you offer to this space, to this moment with yourself, the more you will receive from it. Your dance with the universe is witnessed as you slow down. The human being, the human experience itself, craves to be seen, to be felt, to be witnessed. The first offering to yourself, therefore also offered to the whole, the interconnected we, is the quality of your presence. To mentally step into this space with your heart in your hands, bringing with you the deepest respect in your approach. And the way you witness the uncomfortable, the boring, the confusing, letting it all be a sacred mystery, addressing this mystery with respect, patiently letting it be, experiencing it as it comes. No matter where the mind may stray, letting the beautiful and the terrifying of the human experience be welcomed. Let it have refuge in your temple of awareness. Devotion to the fullest extent. Letting your body be the altar.
letting your mind be a temple of refuge. Offering an asylum where each aspect of you, each aspect of the human being, can witness themselves in radical honesty, undressing obscuring judgment, a sacred home of neutrality. For the inner monk and the criminal, the wounded, the selfless and the selfish, the virgin and the whore, where understanding constructs the temple walls not expectations. Taking a moment to breathe and witness the sensations in this human temple the life in action. Knowing all is welcome. Nothing needs to be changed. Approaching the self with a desire to see. To witness. Perhaps even love. Not to correct, not to change not to judge. You, a Buddha, with your individual, multifaceted human experience. Forgiving your own mistakes and judgments with the very heart of God. Letting your relationship to you be your altar, be the tending to your temple. Tenderly washing your feet each day loving and patiently cleansing them, no matter what you have walked through. Letting love wipe the slate clean each night, until love is the force that transforms and not shame. A sacred altar, a blessed temple you came into this world with. It is you, your life, your relationships, your mind, your body 
your perspective. Can you wash the dishes as an act of sweeping the temple hall? Cooking, to feed, to bless the human mouths so they may be infused with a loving meal. Can you welcome the exiled the ashamed, the holy, the nun, the arrogant, the childish. Can you create an altar for them of patience, of tender care and forgiveness? Loka, Samasta, Sukino, Bhavantu. Loka, Samasta, Sukino, Bhavantu. Loka, Samasta, Sukino, Bhavantu. May this altar awaken remembrance into those seeking, ease those suffering, and lend an infinite ear of understanding. Let your presence be a gift a service, an altar, a temple, a haven. Rest here in meditation. As you are ready, lovingly awaken your body to this present moment, taking a deeper breath than you have yet to take. Breathe into your heart space. caring for yourself as an act of devotion to the innate worthiness of all beings, to the innate worthiness in all aspects of you. (laughs) 